What's good, fellow hype beasts? Uh, it's your boy since the premiere, and today, uh, about a, 10 days away from the lookbook for the spring summer 2017 collection being released. Um, so I figured we might as well take a dive into some of the leaked items so far. Give you, I give you my thoughts on them and some items that have uh, popped up as quote unquote leaks um, that I'm pretty pretty stoked for. Not sure, obviously, with them being leaks, what is actually going to get made and what isn't. First up is um, in the item that we got for the teaser, and it was just that a teaser we only got one photo it looks like the potential Marlboro collaboration uh, cowboy horse pretty straightforward so I can see why they would allude to a Marlboro collaboration because he does look like he could be the Marlboro man on the back of that jacket do enjoy the jacket probably wouldn't purchase it it's not really my style but it is a supreme piece nonetheless pretty dope jacket if we move right along you can see shout out to jay Prem though he always comes through in the clutch with potential leaks collaborations drop dates things of that nature so shout out to jay Prem. so yeah i don't know if this is a mock-up this looks like it's just a mock-up and not really a leak of that at all but we get to see the potential marlboro denim jacket yeah this mock-up if this is a um what actually the jacket looks like i'm definitely not really too interested in it but it is a cool jacket i can see some people adding it to their repertoire and making some dope fits with it um, moving right along um, we have this photo of what also could be potential marlboro collaborating um it does look like it's a potential marlboro logo on there and that is one of the skaters for supreme i believe um, correct me if I'm wrong. I'm sure they'll do it in the comments below. Um, moving right along. This I am excited for. Um, the Rap-A-Lot Records collaboration, which seems like it's right up Supreme's alley. Last season, they did do a Noriega, a Capone Noriega collaboration, which is really cool. I grabbed the shirt out of that. This one, it seems like it's sick. Uh, looks like they got a Ghetto Boys tee. Honestly, I'm sure it fly. It's no brainer. And then the coach's jacket, which I, I'm a huge fan of. I always love coach's jackets. And just in general, just the Rap A Lot Records logo over everything for the most part. Simple black pieces. Like, you really can't go wrong with this. I do hope it's not just a mock up and it is uh, something that will actually drop because I am excited for this collaboration. Uh, the Motion Logo Crew Neck. I haven't been successful grabbing any Motion Logo items thus far, but feeling like this season might be my season. If they do drop the Motion Logo Crew Neck, I will be trying to cop 100% and it will be manual manual boys all day you know how we do you know we got some mock-ups here of what potentially could be dropping as far as colorways pink seemed like last season was just or the honestly the past couple seasons pink has just been a top seller as far as them selling out instantly any peach pink light colored I don't know what it is me myself I am a camo dude and then a black black dude so other than me being an actual black dude, my color choice is camo, black. I'll go for a gray, I'll go for a navy. I keep it pretty simple. I'm hoping they are releasing this and it's not just a mock-up and not just a tease. T-shirts, I'm huge into Supreme t-shirts. Just in general, graphic tees are a, a go-to staple for me. They do tons of graphic tees and really good ones too. I enjoy Supreme's graphic tees a lot. Um, this shirt, apparently, it was a photo that wasn't used in the Supreme calendar, but it is a sick photo uh, for, and it is a very Supreme shirt, I would say. White chick with the cheeks, little bubble, little bubble butt. This one's awesome. I believe this photo is of a monk who set himself on fire. I'm not sure. I'm sure you guys will correct me in the comments below. This one I can't wait for. This, this graphic tee is awesome. Fuck the president. I feel like this shirt will draw in people who don't even fuck with Supreme, which Supreme is known for drawing in people who don't usually fuck with the brand. Supreme had to do something political. Yeah, everybody has an opinion on him. Leave it to Supreme to keep that opinion pretty blunt and straightforward. So I can't wait for this shirt to drop. I'm gonna try to cop this one. All three sh shirts that I pre that have leaked so far, I'm probably gonna try to grab, you know, all of them. 
just because I can always use more t-shirts, graphic t-shirts, and I dug all of them. A uh, bomber jacket that um, they apparently is a leak. I, I haven't been able to find it in past season, so it, I, I, up to this point, it looks like it's going to be a potential release for the season. Definitely enjoy the, the, the bomber jacket style. That wave is, I don't think it's going anywhere anytime soon. It looks like there's some uh, white stitching along the shoulder, along the interior flap. That's really cool. I'm excited to see what other colorways it comes in, but that black one is looking mighty fine with the Supreme International logo is what it's called. The Supreme Dad Hat. I'm not sure about this. One, I don't think this is real, but it did come from, I guess, trusted sources. If this hat drops, I'm not sure. I feel like it'll move. It does remind me of something Dime would do, or does. I don't think they've done anything like this in the past few seasons uh, as far as the re resurgence of dad hats. I don't think it's real, but it could totally, that logo is just looking like fucked up to me, that Supreme, but that might be just what they wanted. Rain jacket, I mean, honestly, this looks like a simple piece that everybody's gonna wanna cop. One of those items that is gonna sell out super fast just because it's not heavy branding. It's all along the arm and it's it actually has a purpose. Most of my Supreme pieces I buy tend to fill a need, whether I need a jacket, a book bag, a brick, crowbar. I don't have a quality rain jacket. So obviously when Supreme does it, I'm gonna try to get it. For something like this that I would wear all the time, I might be looking more towards a black one. Ah, uh, the puzzle. So I remember a couple weeks ago, uh, something happened on a Supreme website. Items, descriptions got leaked and they were posted on the website under last season's items. And one of the items that was on there was a, a puzzle. This is looking like a Supreme puzzle. Whether this is real or not, I'm not too sure. When that item description leaked, it didn't say anything about a Louis Vuitton Supreme puzzle. And I can see here, if you look closely, you can obviously see the, obviously see the Louis Vuitton print within the puzzle. So I'm wondering if it is one real, an actual real item, and two, if it is a Supreme Louis Vuitton puzzle. Does that mean make it 10 times harder to, to cop? I'm not too sure. I was interested in the puzzle from jump, but if it's a Supreme Louis Vuitton collaboration, I've already been running into roadblocks, trying to get the pieces from that collaboration between Supreme and Louis Vuitton. We'll have to see when it comes to that time. I'll have another video I'll be uploading as far as the, the steps that I've been going through to try to acquire some of those Supreme Louis Vuitton items um, in another video. If this is the actual puzzle and if Supreme is selling it, I will be trying to grab it. And I'm sure everybody else will who is super into the accessories because Supreme makes really good accessories. What do you guys think of the items that have leaked so far? I'm excited for them. I'm excited for the season. How are you guys feeling about it? Do you even care about the season? Is Supreme even matter to you? Is it on your radar anymore? Don't forget to leave a thumbs up for this video. Hit subscribe if you want to see more. It's your boy, Sis Supreme, and I'm out.